guys, this is your guy Ali again from the Ghana Dream Channel and I am back with another episode of Building Our Dream House in Ghana. You know, um, today is another exciting day. Uh, we have the barristers going on. We already started working with the barristers that's going to be going on in the house. Uh, we decided to do the barristers uh, because we're going to be living here for a little bit and uh, I have kids and I want to make sure they are safe and secure. We went yesterday to buy all the materials. We have two by three dishes, two by two dishes right here. And we have the round pipes. I'd like to go around with you guys and show you how the job is going on. They already start working on the barrister. That's the host they're digging over there. On, you know, each side of the stairs. When you come up this way, this is how it's going to look. This is the top level. Level of the barrister that will go this way in a flat way, you know. So, um, we're gonna see more videos and show how it's going on, you know, uh, as they went. The barristers are going on, the beauty of the house is coming out with the stonework. This is beautiful. Yeah, okay guys, um, as you guys can see, uh, we decided to go with this style, which is very simple, uh, we didn't want to do a lot. Uh, although it's not done yet, there's a little bit more features that we're going to be putting in the um, design, especially at the top end uh, of the barrister. You know by the flat bars you know when you're looking at it close um i'm happy with the work these guys are doing and uh so far all we need to be done is painting we have to get their first coat which is the anti-rust painting and uh, continue with the features that we have to put in it uh, on this side of the house we're not planning to do anything um you know we're just gonna leave it here like a you know green area uh planting some few things that we're gonna need you know to have the organic going on um <laughs> all right um as y'all see we already set up the pool for the basketball court you know area uh, <clears throat> just left with um you know a no? little bit here and there you know putting concrete on the floor you know backboard and stuff like that Uh, this is the back of the house. The pool is still there. Uh, we decided not to touch the pool yet because there's, you know, a little bit more work to be done. And I uh, also decided to close the gym area, you know, divide it from the pool area, you know, for safety, you know, and also for the kids. Um, yeah. Yeah. And also the pool will also um, have a division, you know, for safety for the kids either glass work or metal work uh, to divide it from the main house. Um, yeah, um, this is a setup we have on this side, you know. Uh, yeah, um, so from here is going to lead you to the front of the house um, and we decided to set up um, you know a gazebo on this side you know you know like an outside kitchen with you know the uh, barbecue area you know just in case you want to have some few get together or you know house party and stuff like that um, so far um, the work is almost done you know pretty much I would say about 80 to 90 percent of the barristers is done already uh we also 
was able to do the flower parts you know for the demarcation of, of the landscaping uh which is also done we have a um, little bit more plastering and um, probably graffiado work and stuff we're gonna do at the front uh we don't want to rush doing anything we're gonna take it step by step all right um well this is the back of the house uh leading to the top we have the same style we do at the front you know what i'm saying yeah so that's how you get to the top of the house with the same style baristas again we're gonna put in some designs in it to make it more homey you know what i'm saying Yeah, um, so this is the uh, the top roof area. Um, same thing, we set up a canopy, you know, probably some pool table, you know, and uh, also some barbecue area on that area. Ali made this grill. We was uh, looking for a grill. They had some like rinky dink grill you find in a wall. Um, what is a Walmart for like, you know, usually you find it for like fifty dollars, sixty dollars. They were selling it for almost two hundred dollars here in Ghana. Ali was like, and it was like really small. Like you can blow it with your breath and it'll fall. So he was like, no, I'm gonna build a grill. So this man got some welders and did all of this. So now. We have a grill for Eid. <laughs> So basically, they're breaking the stones into pieces and in the shape that they needed, that they will use for the work. This is how the stones right here. Look. And when it's ready, you drop it on this side. Listen man, this is beautiful. I like the job this guy is doing. Everything looks straight, clean, sharp edges. That is nice. That's exactly what I wanted to see. <laughs> 